But like in Star Trek, we recorded like the first 30 minutes of the music and we all thought it was so wonderful and it sounded great. It was a hundred piece orchestra and it sounded magnificent. And there's something very ego satisfying for composers. I could say, I have a hundred piece orchestra. Frankly, I think it's a lot of nonsense. You only get so much noise on, on the soundtrack. Anyway, we recorded, we thought it was wonderful. And then next day I get a call from Bob Wise and he says, it's not working. I said, what do you mean, Bob? It sounds great. No, it's not working. He said, well, what's wrong? And he's trying to find the words and he finally says, there's no theme. And I started thinking about it. And he was right, there was no theme. There was a lot of fancy footwork, which forced me back to the, you know, start all over again, rather embarrassing. It had been a costly mistake. And subsequently I wrote the theme, which is now this, the Star Trek theme, which is a standard piece of music now.